Stierli. Motoro. Kuhn. That's quite a dig from all of 45 yards from Kuhn, the skipper. The last leads man to make the 600 landmark was Jack Charlton, but now here's Cooper. Beyonder got in the way of that. Now Madeley. Again the deflection, Jordan Clark. Jordan, go! How did Clark do it? How did Clark find a way through that mass of legs? Let's see, let's see how this happened. The deflection. It's Clark and Jordan who are there. That's Jordan's header. Now here's Clark with his back to the goal and defenders would be him at the goal. Out goes the toe and it's in. Alan Clark's fourth goal of the season in the 13th minute. Um, uh, Paul Madeley running down the middle. Again, a bit of pushing. And this time, it is awarded. It is a penalty. And this is how it happened. The push. If... Well, that looked a less clear case than the previous one. But certainly, Mr. Kaiser had no doubt. And has awarded a penalty to Leeds United. And here's the chance for Leeds United to score two goals for the first time in a match this season. And it's Lorimer. And he's done it. <laughs> 25 minutes gone. Here's the pen. Very gently, he didn't build it, just placed it. That's a free kick to FC Zurich. Quickly taken by Martinelli, pushed up to Jean Dupin, who's turning on it and trying the shot just over the top. Took it quickly. Had to snatch at it and put it over the top. The last minute of normal time in the first half. That's Clark Ziglig. They're going to go also in trouble. Clark! Oh! What a goal! That was a remarkable angle. Watch this for Enterprise. Jordan plays it back. Now, first time, left foot on the swerve at a most acute angle. 3 0. Giles. So Jordan gets his first of the season. A happy man now. Brian Clough left him out of the league side. He would have been in tonight. The scoreline, Leeds United 4, FC Zurich 0. Giles. Jonathan chasing that. Hunter. Another good cross for Jordan. Almost creeping under the bar before Grove put it over. There's the cross from Norman Hunter. Just dropping under the bar as Jordan challenged and Grove puts it over. FC Zurich getting ready to... Robbed by Lorimer. Madeley. Lorimer. It was Ziggerly who got it now. Giles. Clark. made it five hit the upright it's out of play that's how close Alan Clark was to another Zurich not really knowing how to plug the gaps Joe Jordan says give it me up for Clark again the woodwork again the woodwork again from Lorimer Here's Clark's first, the header. It will come to Lorimer and the same piece of timber. Beyond, uh, that's a nice ball for Katish. Kuhn. Stierling. Martinelli, Bonteron, 
Oh, what a good shot! That really was a good shot by Bosman. A fine save by Harvey. Watch the way Bosman hits this. Really swerved it, bent it considerably, and a good save by Harvey. Now mainly. Jordan is onside. The linesman says Jordan is onside. He missed it. The linesman looked at it, kept his flag down. Joe Jordan thought about it. Where am I going to put it? Into the side netting. John Dupur. Gantic. Again, Jean Dupin, Kuhn lurking. Good cross. It's, yes, it's a goal. Well deserved. Ilya Kratic, a very well deserved goal. And well worked by Kuhn, the skipper. Slipped it past Cooper. And beautifully finished off by Ilya Kratic. Marty, the whistle has gone, it is all over, and Leeds United scoring four goals where previously this season they've only scored one, have given their spectators something to shout about, it's early days yet to say that this is the Leeds United of old.